Hello everybody, it's the Game Corner here, and today we continue playing a game called Kindergarten. Let's get straight into it. This time I got Cindy's salad, so hopefully she'll like it. Oh hey boyfriend, I saved you a spot. Go get something and uh, to eat and come sit with me. I have slop. Oh good, I was just thinking about- oh darn it. Yeah, I, she's a vegan. She doesn't like your mama. Blah blah blah. Hey, sweetie, would you be a darling go get me something vegan? Something vegan? Yeah, you know, um, like, I don't know exactly what it means, but I know it's just good. So just ask around and see if you can find something vegan. Oh, and the slop isn't vegan. Here's a salad. Ugh, a salad? Oh, now that I think about it, I guess it, that would be vegan, huh? Gross. Why do I do this to myself? I don't know. You're being so good to me today. You're probably the most well-trained boy I ever met. I should use you for something at recess. Hmm, I have an idea. And if you guys haven't seen, go check back in the last video because I also did this part. I just wanted to do like I just wanted to say this little part because it was a little bit different. So I will be like probably going back all the way to show and tell. Okay, so now I'm gonna show the flower now that Bugs is not gonna be here to beat me up. A flower. That's pretty boring. What's there even to tell about that? It's not boring. I gave it to him because he's been a good boyfriend all day. Trust me, it's boring. We're just gonna skip you and move on to someone more interesting. Okay, who's next? It's not gonna be hard to beat that, so don't be shy. Well, children, that was a little fun show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had a fun day today. I'll see you all tomorrow. Alright, and here we all go. So we're gonna get like this part now that she's happy. That was so sweet of you to show the flower to everyone. You are you really are the best boyfriend I ever had. You can keep it forever and always. Joy. I'll be seeing you tomorrow, boyfriend. See you then. Oh, okay, so we, yeah, we do get the flower. And we got another hint, so that's cool too. Okay, so now we're I think we're gonna go for Jerome's quest. Um, but first, oh yeah, because we got these two items. We could also get a key as well. Let's read these Monster Man cards. This is the Wizard Worm card. Not to be confused with Mage, Maggot, or Sorcerer Serpent. Okay. This is the King Tower Beetle card. He's just a rec regular beetle that lives in King's Tower. Oh, okay. This is the Doom Jelly card. Goes perfectly with Doom Peanut Butter. Alright. I think we're gonna go to Jerome's now. I don't think we need to have any extra money for this. We do need to buy like three items though, but all right, he could beat me up. That's okay. We need like three items. Might as well get a little bit more stuff. According to that hint, I think there was like one more that I didn't read, uh, so I'll probably read it in a bit. Fine here, bugs. At least I get my five dollars still. Uh, but that's okay. Let's see about that hint. That we didn't read. You need to have the cigarettes by the time you go to get the laser pointer from the bathroom. Oh yeah, cause like um, that hall monitor's in there and he smokes. Okay, hey Monty. All right, I want to buy something and let's see what's for sale. I know we're gonna need the yo-yo. We're gonna need the cigarettes and maybe the screwdriver. Then I don't. I, I know we don't need a voice recorder. That was for Cindy. Okay, so yeah, yo-yos. Don't don't know about these things, but Jerome loves them. All right, let's have that yo-yo. Let's buy the cigarettes, and let's buy screwdriver. Got this sucker off the janitor for a steal. It's weird that he's willing to sell me the tools provided by school, but I ain't complaining. I'll run you a dollar. I wonder what you paid him. If it's th if this is just a dollar, then you must have paid him less. You need to make some po profit. Thought you're doing business with you. Don't need anything else. Let's talk to Jerome. I think he doesn't really talk to you in this time. I'm Jerome. I don't think you're cool enough to talk to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is cool? All the stuff that uh, Monty sells is pretty cool, except for voice recorders. Yeah, because I needed to buy everything else. Noted. Not, not that it matters to you. I always spend my time out here alone. I might put up with you during morning time if you got me something cool to show me. Noted. I think I got something, so I'll show you in a second. Okay, children. It's time to start the day. Everyone head inside for morning time. Good morning, children. It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time. Or you could be sad, pathetic, and alone. As long as you're the best you can be. Go find your partner. Let's see, Jerome. Dude, you, you know you're not cool enough to talk to me. Let alone be my morning buddy. Besides, Monty is gonna hook me up with a sweet yo-yo. You mean this yo-yo? 
Oh, come on. He told me he was going to save that for me. You could have it if you'll be my buddy. You got a deal, and since we're going to be friends, I think you should do something to help me out. You know, as a friend. Like what? You know that creepy old janitor? He stole my laser pointer this morning. He said it was too bright and shiny for his old eyes. I need your help to get it back. What do I do? When you're ready, I'll give you a hall pass. You can use it to get by the hall monitor. Once you're past him, head to the janitor's closet. My laser should be in there somewhere. I can do that. Awesome. It should be in a box somewhere. Just grab it and go. Don't linger there too long. He checks back frequently. Got it. Just let me know when you're ready. I'll give you the pass. Uh, I won't be able to distract the teacher for long. So head straight for the door. Don't talk to anyone on your way out. I'm ready. Go distract her. All right, let's go over there and not take anything from here. Hey, hall monitor. Not so fast, little dude. I'm gonna need to see your hall pass before I can let you by. Here's my pass. A crystal pass? Whoa, yeah. Go do whatever, man. Sweet. I need to go in here. Just gonna ignore the blood. Is it gonna be in the stolen stuff up here? Let's see. This box is too high to reach. I need to find a way to get down before I can look inside. Okay. Let's see. Is it in this box? There's a note. Months run card and a $5 bill. Oh, that's how we can get another $5. Maybe that's how we get, like, that $15 thing. Uh, maybe later, though. I'm not gonna do anything with this, because I need to complete this story first. Okay. Can I bring it the bucket? Can I do something? Let's see. Oh, we can do something here. It looks like this screw is- Oh, this is why we need a screwdriver. I don't think the, um, gender is gonna like this, you know? Uh, don't- Okay. I thought I was gonna plow, like, the little child down, you know? It's like, it's literally my height. I'm not counting the hair, either. There's a bunch of junk in here along with Jerome's laser pointer. Let's take laser. And let's get out of here, because I know the janitor will come back. Hey, man, you heard the bell? Go back to your class. Alright, alright, I'm here, I'm here. Well, did you get it? What? Okay, kids, we all heard the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. I hear we're having a slop today. How exciting. We'll talk at lunch. Okay, let's go to lunch. Hey, kid, over here. Well, did you get it? I got it. Dude, that's awesome. I just hope the Jan doesn't know notice. He can be pretty tutorial. Which one of you ten little children went into my closet? <laughs> Oh, jeez. Sounds like he knows. You better hurry up and hide that thing before he gets here. If he catches you with it, you're a dead man. Where do I hide it? Um, the garbage can. Quick. Throw it in there. Alright, alright. I'll do it quick. I know what he does with that mop. Well, anyone want to step forward? No? Well, what a surprise. What about you, little junior principal? I took your lasery thing in this morning. I'm sure you want it back. Search me, man. I don't have it. Or, so screw off, or I'll tell my dad you peed in the water fountain again? Again? You win this round, kid. What about you? You been in my closet? T turn out your pockets. Hmm, nothing. I still got mad on you. Oh, just leave the poor things alone. You're always looking for a reason to impale a child on that mop of yours. So what if I am? Ain't nothing wrong with impaling a child. Yes, there's a wrong with impaling child. Just go sell your mystery meat. Fine, but mark my words, someone will pay for going in my closet. Actually, before you get started, that garden can needs to empty- Oh no. Go take care of it, we just put something in there. Grumble, grumble, stupid lunch lady making me do my stupid job. Ah, oh, there goes the laser pointer. Jerome's not gonna be happy. Well, that was fast, there's no way you took it all the way to the dumpster. Would you relax, woman? I dropped it off in the bathroom. I'll get it after the bell rings. Oh, that's where we need the cigarettes. Sheesh, old bro brood is just mad the kids like my food better than hers. Well, that didn't go quite as planned. At least you're not dead. That's a relief. What now? I hate to ask this of you, but you need to go get it. The janitor said that it's in the bathroom. What's in it for me? I know I'm asking a lot from you, but just work with me on this. I'll make it worth you a while. Can you at least say it? Fine. I'll go pay off the lunch lady so you can get out. Just hurry back. The general will be taking that garbage out shortly after the bell rings. Go pay her off then. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to go get it now. 
Okay, she said she'll let you out. Go get it. Fine. There goes Lily. There goes me. Don't worry, I'm not gonna get you in trouble this time. Alright. Huh? You, you're not supposed to be in here. I gotta take you to the principal. That is unless... Unless what? Well, I'm out of cigarettes. If you had some, I'll be willing to let you off. Hmm, you can have two options here. But I do. Heck yeah. Thank you so much, little guy. Go do what you gotta do. Cool, thanks. See you around, little man. See ya. Cool. Looks like I'm digging through this after all. Get the stupid laser pointer. Alright, at least we got it. Alright, now we have to go back to Jerome. Oh, did the slop give you the run? Sorry about that. Hope it worked itself out. All the other kids are out on the recess now. Go run along. Alright. Jerome. Oh. He's getting watched like a hawk now. Hey kid, come over here. Jerome briefed me on your little mission. Did you manage to get the laser pointer from the bathroom? Yep. Good. I don't know if you noticed, but the janitor, but the janitor is watching Jerome a little too closely. He looks like he's about to kill him. We gotta do something about it. What do you mean? That old man has been harassing kids for decades. I think it's time we finally got even with him. How do we do that? Doesn't he sell you your stuff? Who doesn't? And when it comes down to it, the principal kid is far more valuable than an unstable or ring octogenarian willing to sell me tools at a cheap price. Good point, what what should I do? I'm gonna take the laser as a collateral for my services here today. He'll get it back when he pays me. Okay, now what? Jerome gave me this. It's one of his dad's little bugs. Little things tend to pop up if they don't like what they hear. Don't worry, I deactivated it. You just worry about putting it behind the janitor without him seeing you. I'll handle the rest. Come see me when it's done. Okay. Aw, there's a little X mark the spot. Should I place the device here? Yes. Alright. Did you place it? Yep. Excellent, this is gonna be good. Now, Jerome, get back here. I ain't done questioning you yet. Okay, it, it was a good explosive? Jeez, dude, I told you to distract him, not blow him up. Eh, he had it coming. The janitor just exploded. Yes, he did. The irony here is that there's no one to clean up the parts. Yeah. Can we just go inside? Yes, I think they'll be for the best. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? I don't think you'll like me showing the hall pass, but let's see what happens. Hey, that's one of the Prince's Wall's hall passes. He said there was one missing this morning. I can't believe you stole it. Oh, now we have to go to the principals. So it was you who stole that pass. Hmm, I thought it was my disappointment of a son who did it. Jerome's not that bad. No, I suppose not, but you are. Am I really? Yes, and I will not tolerate a student who steals from me. Consider yourself expelled. That seems harsh. That's your version of expelled. But all right, let's restart the room and that show the screwdriver instead. All right, buddy. Here, here's my show and tell item. Oh, a screwdriver, that's my favorite drink. Didn't really need to know that, teacher. I'm only in kindergarten. The janitor was mentioning how he wishes he hadn't stole, sold this, his to Monty. Apparently there's a loose shelf in his closet or something. I already, I already loosened it today, so you don't have to worry about that, teacher. Okay, who's next? Well, children, that was a fun show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had fun today. I'll see you all tomorrow. All right, and we're off. Oh, Jerome stayed behind. Well, kid, I'm impressed. You put up with this whole crazy day just because I told you it was be worth it. It is, trust me. It's just a shame it required Monty taking the laser pointer until I pay him back. Either way, you earned this. What is it? It's a mold, mold for a key to my dad's office. You get this made and you go in there anytime. You couldn't just give me a key? How can I even get this made? Monty can hook you up. Just bring it to him at the beginning of the day and he'll figure it out for you. Okay then. This is where the part this is where we part ways. You're pretty cool. I'll see you around. Bye bye bye. Alright, we got a key mold now.
Now we can go into his office for some reason. Alright, Monday time six. Sounds fun. Alright, so now we got this whole desk all filled up. I think I want to take this to school right now. Lunch pass you got from the teacher after getting six gold stars in one day. You can use this to spend your lunch time with the teacher. Alright, let's bring it to school. I think that'll be alright. Uh, let's see if there's any hints for this as well. Uh, we got a lot of hints for the teacher. Um, let's see here. Oh, this is just for her quest. So I'm not sure. So I'll just go in there. Because I know we just completed her. We completed her. We completed Jerome's. And we completed the teachers. We're going to have to have bugs. I know what to do. to start his. And then Nugget over here. You need, oh, we need Cindy's flower for that. So maybe I'll do it after I do this. Alright, I think that'll be good. And then we could do Lily's. Alright, let's get this day started. I don't think we need any lunch money right now. So I don't know what ha what we do to start this, but I'll figure it out. Teacher, I miss Applegate. I have been well endowed. Ahem. With excellent teaching quality. Yeah, I sure you have. Eh, if we want to get on our good side, I think we're going to need maybe the poo. Okay, so let's go through this whole Billy thing that we did the first episode just quickly. Yeah, she's speaking normally now. Third person, Billy. I need to know. Whatever, Nugget. Oh, it's just gonna be that. All right. I guess I'll go through with this. We'll get going then. The principal is an impatient man. Maybe it's different from the other ones, but who knows. So, I've been told that you're feeling sad about Billy. Who told you that? Oh, you know, the world just gets uh, around, you know? It doesn't matter how I know, it's just that I do know. Um, okay, so what about it? That all of this is about, right? Billy's missing and it's making you sad. You're trying not to find him or anything. You're just sad he's gone, right? Phew, okay. That makes this whole a lot easier. A whole lot easier. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna give you something and I want you to take it whenever you're feeling sad about Billy. What is it? Just a little something I ordered from this exact reason. Here, take whenever you miss Billy too much, okay? And it's the pills that you gave Nugget. All right. You're giving me pills? Just don't tell anyone you got them from me. The hall monitor is waiting to take you back to class. Please head outside. All right, we'll do then. Bye, Mr. Principal Man. Welcome back. I hope everything turned okay with the principal. Everything is fine. Say, the principal didn't happen to give you any anything, did he? He gave me some pills. Oh, lucky day. You wouldn't mind uh, if your lovely teacher had one now, would you? Be my guest. Good boy. Gulp. Oh, that's nice. Thank you for that. Go on and enjoy the rest of your morning time. I know I will. Cool. And uh, you're still good. Oh, you actually don't care. Hey, don't go snooping around and... You know what? I don't really care. Do whatever you want. Well, that's cool. Let me guess. Is this another five bucks? Probably. Okay, but that's really good to know. We could get the nugget that way, too. So maybe I could do that to do a lot of things. All right, so you're such a role model. Hmm. Maybe I have to give it to her during lunch or whatever. I don't know. But there's another one of those little devices. And then we could have... And let's at least get a couple things here. Let's take the months run card. Let's take the money. Uh, I guess we could also maybe take the knife too. We have a lot of things to do right now. This is Bugs Cubby. That's a knife. Getting caught with this would get me in serious trouble. And for right now, we're fine. This is Jerome's cubby. There's a strange device in here. Let's take that device. Uh, I think we're okay right now. Man, we could take this. It, it's not really doing anything right now. So. Okay, kids, that's the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for a nutritious... Oh, this is where I can use it. I hear we're having slop today. How exciting. I want to have lunch with you. Oh, fiddlesticks. There goes my smoke break. Very well. You could have a special lunch with me today. Excellent. The rest of you run along to the cafeteria. Having special- Oh, give me a happy meal! Oh, that's cool. Having special lunch with my favorite student instead of getting a smoke break is one of my favorite things about teaching. Here's a McLob silly meal. Oh, nope, it's McLob. <laughs> Knock yourself out. I hear they come with one of those silly monster run cards in them. Oh, cool, I get two in one day. I don't really do much anything else during this time. Just wait here until the bell rings. How exciting. 
Finally! Okay, let's go pick your lesser classmates and head off to recess. Well, I guess that's it then. Hmm. Nothing really happened. I got all this stuff now, so... Hmm. Still got... Let's see what you needed to say anything. Go play while you're still young and thin. Sure. Uh, can I sell anything? Uh, oh, I can't sell any of these? Okay, fine. Uh, let's see... Cindy, don't think I could do too, too many things right now. Uh, get out of here, I'm busy. Fine. Okay. Anyways, maybe I could do this duck puzzle. I need to write th some stuff down. Let's see. I'll come back when I, like, write everything down so I can start doing it. Okay, so I, uh, took a picture of the riddle, so I think I will get it from here. So I need... The uh, duck that's further south, which is this duck right here, and I need to click it twice. So there's once, and I need to twice. Okay, so then two blue before red. Sound like a bark. Then red. Quack. Quack. After we turn to the first duck, and then blue. Oh, cool, we get a monster run card. Okay, so I guess we could have died if we didn't do a thing. Okay, so now we got three monster run cards. Cool. All right. I don't think we could do too much of anything else. So I think I'm just gonna end the day here. That's the bell. Let's all head back inside for show and tell. All right, let's go inside. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? Your favorite item? Whoa, there a whole bottle? You must have really been up in the principal's business today, huh? Hey kid, you ever want someone to take those off your hands? I got a pretty penny for you. Hands off, Monty. I called first. Aw, oh, man. Now that that's settled, who wants to go next? So, who's next? Well, children, that was a fun show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had a fun day today. I'll see you all tomorrow. Okay. So basically today I just got a lot of Munsman cards. That's nice. So next I think I'm going to try to go for um, Nuggets quest. So I think I also need to collect the Nuggets for Nugget. So I think I'm going to have to do the teacher thing again too. I'm not going to really read these because it's not too like informational. Eh. Let's just go grab this. Alright. Am I ready to start another day in kindergarten? Yes, I am. Alright, Nugget. Hi, my friends call me Nugget. Or, oh wait, no, maybe I can't do that since I want to be your friend, so I'm going to have to trick Jerome. Alright, I'll be your friend. What is your offering? I have a flower. This was given to you by Cindy, yes? There was great love in this flower. She really cares for you more than her other seven four boyfriends she had this month. Perhaps you do know love. Perhaps. There are other things Nugget has seen, but is told to forget. Nugget forgot love. I do not wish to forget anymore. Take this Nugget of Friendship. Why? Bring together the other Nuggets of Friendship at by recess, and Nugget will reveal all. How many are there? There are five in total? Okay, you already have one. Come see me during morning time, and Nugget will tell you how to get more. Okay, I guess. Nugget also insists you hold on to the strange uh, device. Should you succeed in this task, Nugget will reveal to you what it does. I know it's an explosive, man. And if I fail, Nugget will still reveal what it does. Great. The pretty Lily also knows a great deal about the device. Perhaps gaining her trust would be benefit Nugget's friend. I suppose it was. Would. No more talking now. Shoot. Okay. Hey, Lily. Oh. Um, hey, I'm Lily. You probably heard about what happened to my brother, Billy. I haven't. You haven't? It's been all over, all over the news. He went missing a few days ago. It's hard to hear about that. Thanks. That makes you one of the few people that even seem to care. It's hard to trust anyone here. Cindy has been trying to put gum in my hair. Why? I don't know, but if I were you, I'd stay away from her. She's really mean. Thanks for the tip. Well, let's see about that um, hint about her. Uh, first one, you need to have the special items from Monty, Nugget, and Bugs in order to complete Lily's mission, so I'll probably have to do that later because that's a lot of items. Uh, okay, so maybe it's not this one, maybe it's this one. Let you go through the cubbies if you give her a pill. Yeah, but I don't think I have a pill. Uh, 
so I don't really know. Uh, trial and error. Well, it says something about gum, so maybe I need to give it to her. If, if you'll let me. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. I told me the cutest couple in school, but first you'll have to do something for me. Like what? See that girl over there? That's Lily. She's by far the ugliest, nastiest girl. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, yeah. This is going to be great. She finally gets what she deserves. Uh, like Just like her brother did for dumping me. Come find me for this morning time after you after you've done it. I'm Yeah, yeah, dumping you. That's why you had seven boyfriends this month, dude. You're they're not the problem, you are. I wouldn't try yeah. Oh cool, I get to give her the um gum. She gave this to you? Wow, she can't even do her own dirty work. I'm ugly enough without having gum in my hair. Thank you for doing it. You're not ugly. Oh, thanks. I guess Cindy has been getting to me lately. I pre appreciate the compliment. You're nice. Thanks. I'm not really looking to be friends right now, but I do trust you for whatever that's worth. I'll see you around. Okay, so that's good. I got her to trust me, and I know I'm going to need to buy that yo-yo. I need that other nugget of truth, so. Or, yeah, friendship. Alright, let's buy that yo-yo. Alright, fine. Give me it. Eh, I have another apple. Maybe I need a screwdriver or something, too. Why not? Alright. Um, so let's go to... Well, inside. It's buddy time. Alright, morning time. Let's go to Nugget. Nugget friend returns! Does he wish to continue on his quest to retrieve the five nuggets of friendship? Sure. Nugget. Nugget is pleased with your persistence. One of the nuggets is hidden within the room. It's not really hidden. It's in your cubby, Nugget. Nugget holds the other. You must find the hidden nugget before you get one Nugget holds. Okay, I'll be back with it. I need to go distract the teacher. Alright, so the yo-yo. Alright, here we go. Like what? What do I do? I can do that. Got it. And go distract her while I disobey you and go get the nugget. This is Nugget's cubby. There appears to be a nugget of some sort in here. Let's take the nugget. And now Monty's and Jerome's gonna be mad at me. Get over here, kid. You blew it. No way she's gonna put up with another distraction. I'm screwed. Give me my pass back. Good. Now get out of here. You wasted enough of my time today. Sure. Alright, so I guess we'll give this to Nugget to get the other one. Have you found the second nugget of friendship? Yes. Wonderful! Nugget is impressed. The trial of cubbies is normally very difficult for Nugget's per potential friends. Do you see the pretty lily over there? Nugget like- Aw, Nugget has a crush! Nugget likes the pretty lily. Nugget has written the pretty lily in a pretty poem. You are to deliver it to her. Okay. Let's go deliver it to Lily then. Oh hey, I'm glad you're nice to me this morning and all, but I'm not really looking for a morning buddy right now. I have a letter for Nugget. It's all pink. Oh, oh! I didn't know that he was capable of having complex emotions. It's still a sweet gesture. I just wish I could read it. I guess I could go ask the teacher to read it for me. Sure about that? I don't think she'll be... Um, uh, Miss Applegate? Yes, Lily? What is it? Nugget just gave me this love letter and I was wondering... Oh! Get oh, God. <laughs> Gather around, children. Nugget wrote Lily a love letter. Oh, no, no, no. Nugget's letter is only to be read by Pretty Lily. Nugget likes the Pretty Lily. He also misses her brother, Billy. Please do not continue. Nugget likes the Lily's hair. Nugget likes the smell her chair. Nugget! <laughs> Nugget, do we need to schedule another trip to the school's counselor? This is getting pretty weird. Nugget think you should stop then. Maybe just a few more lines. Nugget said no. Okay, okay, fine, weirdo. As you were, children. She's blushing! Aw, oh, well that was mortifying. Please go away. Okay then, sorry. Nugget! Uh, Nugget noticed. Sorry it happened like that. That was less than ideal. Still, you delivered a letter as you said you would. For that, you have earned the third Nugget of Friendship. Hooray! Come join Nugget at lunch and you'll be told how to continue your quest. Okay, Nugget. Sorry, Nugget. <laughs> Alright, let's go to lunch then. Okay, kids, that's the lunch bell. Let's go down the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. I hear we're having sloppy today. How exciting. Like always. Alright, let's go to Nugget. 
Are you ready to continue your quest for the nuggets of friendship? Sure, I guess. Excellent, it should happen any minute now. What should happen? At every single day, Bugs throws nasty slop at poor Nugget. But today, Nugget has a new potential friend. What am I supposed to do about it? All Nugget needs for you, from you is to make sure that he eats this. Do this simple task and the next Nugget of Friendship is yours. Ah, uh, the poison. Off-color Nugget. Nugget poison it. You want me to kill Bugs? Obviously, Bugs is a bully. He must be taught a lesson if you say so. Well, at least I already know how to make him eat it. So, I already said this last time, so let's just make sure he goes ahead and eats it. You look like a sissy. Uh, Jerome will think you're a sissy. Alright, and then he'll eat the nugget. Bye bye. Well, did you do it? He ate it. Excellent, that pleases the nugget greatly. Now we just wait for him to- Oh, there he goes. You have earned this nugget of friendship. Yes, sir. How do I get the last one? Nugget appreciates your enthusiasm. The last nugget of friendship can be acquired at recess. Nugget will see you then. Okay, see you then, Nugget. Um, also... Nugget love letter did the opposite of the intended effects. Instead of making the pretty Lily feel good, it made her feel bad. It was a weird poem. Could Nugget's potential friend go back and check on the pretty Lily for him? She, look she looks quite red over there by herself. Nugget appreciates that. We'll meet by the nugget cave at recess can't wait yeah she's very red still oh hey sorry for freaking out back there i didn't mean to take it out on you i know nugget is weird and you didn't know he would say those things in that letter yeah i want you to have this donut as apology oh thank you donut it's okay if you say no but i like to see you have it thanks there you go i'm gonna finish lunch alone but it's nice to see Nice to know that we're okay now. I'll see you later. Alright, see you later. Alright, do you need to say anything else to me, Nugget? No more talking now. The last Nugget of Friendship we rebuild at recess. Okay. So let's go to recess. Okay, kiddos, that's the recess bill. Go burn off all the delicious slop you just ate. Let's go to recess. Alright, Nugget. So... It has come to this. Nugget's friend prepares himself to seek the final nugget of friendship. Yep. Do you still possess the strange device Nugget gave you upon the start of your quest? This thing? Nugget has a simple request regarding this device. What is it? Give the device Nugget. Okay. There. Now we may speak of the device. Where, why did you put it over there? The device listens. It knows what Nugget says, and if it does not want, like... What, what it hears, it explodes. So what do we do with it? And you gave it to me. Alright. We must convince it to explode, but we must do it properly. Do you see the statue of the principal over there? It watches us, much like the device listens. We're gonna blow up the statue? No, silly. You're gonna blow up the statue. How? But the device behind the statue, once you have done that, talk to the pretty Lily about poor Billy. The device does not like it when you talk about poor Billy. Got it. Alright, explosive. Good luck. Return it here when you're done. Alright, I will. Let's put it behind the statue. This is a statue of the principal. There's a red light in his eyes. Put the device there. Hey, Billy. I know he did it. I don't know why, but I know he did. The principal took Billy. Ah, what have you done? We're gonna get so much in tr we're gonna get so much in trouble. I hope you have a plan. Uh maybe. Oh my gosh, golly. What? Why the heck did you two blow up the statue of the principal? He's gonna be furious. What? You think I did this? It was all him. He blew up the statue. You can't expect me to believe that, can you, Lily? You spent all day staring at the silly thing, and your feelings towards the principal aren't exactly kind. No, this is so unfair. I was just in the wrong place at the wrong time. I'm sorry, Lily, but you're gonna have to get the principal to believe you. Go to the office. But, but I... Go. Poor Lily. As for you, young man, I don't want to see you because become as bitter as Lily towards the principal. Just give me one reason not to send you to his office, and you're off the hook. Do you like donuts? <laughs> Does it look like I look like donuts? I'm on a diet right now, but one don't, don't hurt, right? Munch. Oh, sweet Jesus, that's good. Yeah, you're totally off the hook. Go play now. Will do. Nugget, we got Lily in trouble. You have done well to blow up the statue. Take this final nugget of friendship. And know that you are truly Nugget's friend. It is time for you to enter the Nugget Cave and... Nugget Cave in its true form. I've already seen it. Alright, I'm ready. 
Excellent, but first, Nugget must do something. What's that? All the nuggets. There, now we're ready. Why did you just drop all those nuggets in the hole? So we do not die upon the landing. Nuggets, nuggets are squishy as they are tasty. Now please enter the nugget cave. All right, let's go, Dramano. Welcome to the nugget cave. Behold its nuggety goodness. Please have a good look around. Yeah, I think we already got the monster run card. I know we don't need it. Oh, I didn't, we didn't look at this before. That's a m memorial for Nugget's good friend, Billy. These flowers have started to die, much like Nugget's hope that he will ever see Billy again. Nugget misses Billy very much. Aw, please flower on memorial. Please do not leave things on Nugget's- Oh, you, you're you leaving a flower. That is quite nice. Do you miss Billy as much as Nugget? Yes. He was the only one before you found the five Nuggets of Friendship. Before you found the five nug nuggets of friendship, he, he nugget nugget can't do this anymore. Do what? Billy told Nugget things before he went missing. Nugget took the principal's pills to help forget, but Nugget does not wish to forget anymore. What do you know? The pills have already done their work. Nugget does not know anything anymore, but Billy gave Nugget something, something that may help you know what Nugget forgot. What is it? Nugget left it in his cubby. Nugget will pre present it to you after the show and tell. Just get through the rest of the day, and Nugget will find you after school. Okay. I guess. That's the bell. We must depart from the Nugget Cave. I'll see you again soon. How do we even get out of here anyways? Never get to see that part. There's no ladder. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for a show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? Nuggets. Is that a chicken nugget? Why are you showing me that? It's one of Nugget's nuggets. It means that this is one of good Nugget's friends. Right. I hope you know what you're getting yourself into. Being Nugget's friend can be challenging. Anyways, who's next? Someone with something more interesting than a Nugget, please. Well, children, that was a fun show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you had all had fun today. I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you all tomorrow. All right. So I guess we're gonna have Nugget showing us something now. Alrighty. Nugget is ready to give you what Billy gave to Nugget. What is it? It's a mysterious note. Nugget can't read, but cannot understand the words left behind by poor Billy. So what should I do with it? It's covered in blood. The pretty Lily is quite upset over Billy's disappearance. Perhaps she would like to know- she would know what to do. Okay. Nugget is quite happy to have a friend again. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, you're crying. I just noticed. I was reading. <laughs> Alright. Well, we got Billy's notes, so I guess we have somebody to read it other than the, uh, probably n definitely not the teacher, but we'll see what happens. If you made it to the end of the video, thank you very much. Let's continue to confuse the others that don't make it to the end. Please comment the word janitor and nothing else. Thank you and have a wonderful day or night. Goodbye.